hello YouTube watch lovers watch collectors and everybody else who decided to join uh, me today welcome to fit out post today we will uh, do a review um, a one month um, of wearing after the purchase uh, the review of this uh, wonderful timepiece it is a citizen eco drive as you can see clearly you can see that um, it has um, a three dials on uh, three sub dials on the main dial one here is the at 10 o'clock is the 24 hours dial where you can see whether it's a.m. or p.m. at this moment it is a um, 204 p.m. as you can clearly see here on the right at 2 o'clock position there is a chronograph dial uh, sub dial and at the 6 o'clock position there is a mode selection sub dial which allows you to choose between chronograph local time and alarm and there's also a date window at 4 o'clock one of the main reasons why I decided to purchase this particular watch uh, was the slide rule bezel as you can see here which is operated by this crown over here these two push buttons are for adjusting the watch and the main crown for adjustment of the uh, of the main time and switching between the modes now after wearing this watch for a month uh, I had some experience with it and I wanted to share that with you uh, um, as you remember when we first did the unpacking of this um, or you may not remember but nevertheless we did the um, weigh the watch with this bracelet during unpacking review and it weighed 187 grams I must say even though it is 187 grams which is but about six ounces or so um, it wears quite comfortable uh, comfortably I cannot complain um, um, what else is there um, th one of the main reasons why as I said to purchase this watch was this slide rule um, bezel and it allows me to do uh, all kinds of calculations and unit conversions on the, on the go which is very convenient and that was the reason why I wanted that in the first place and I did use that and uh, I must say it's uh, it um, it is very rewarding um, the other um, watch specs if you did not watch my original video are as follows the um, case uh, diameter is uh, 48 millimeters the case with uh, uh, lug to lug is 51 millimeters and uh, um, the lug between the lugs the uh, width between the lugs is 22 millimeters um, what else is there um, some people may consider this dial to be very busy and it is it is very busy as you can see there are all kinds of information there but all that information as you can see there is all used you know uh, and usable if you wanted this particular model and that's what I wanted and I'm happy that I have that if I didn't have all that information on the dial there I wouldn't be able to use all that um, what else is there it's easy to read uh, this dial because it's white and all the uh, um, you know markings on the bezel and, and the dial are made in black color the uh, hour markers are all applied and um, I must say this watch has a very good loom um, you can easily see all our markers and the hands and, and in the dark which is very convenient um, what else is there the bracelet is uh, is very good I was able to adjust it very easily to my 70 inch wrist and uh, um, I must say I was uh, very happy wearing that I wanted to share with you also a couple of other things here um, for example let me bring my screen for you here is the same watch on uh, on a big screen um, let me 
show to you what website that is. This is a citizen website. And um, as you can see, this model uh, on that website is called Bryson. Uh, the MSRP value of this watch is, as you can see from here, is 495 US dollars. But uh, I purchased this watch from um, uh, from Mark from um, Island Watch Company, uh, as you can see here, and the price uh, he was selling it for was 255 dollars, as you can see here on the screen, which was very good deal, and um, I was happy to to buy that at that price. And I must say, this uh, watch is worth it, um, every penny of that. Uh, another and the last thing that I forgot to mention is that this watch has an uh, an a perpetual calendar, a real perpetual calendar, which means there is no need to adjust a date on this watch uh, for longest time ever until the year 2100 when uh, all the uh, perpetual calendars would need to be adjusted. So, well, this is uh, more or less my experience with it. And this is the website I where I purchased it from. Um, I see that he has that out of stock right now, but I'm pretty sure if you contact him, Mark would be happy to, uh, to order some for you uh, and sell you that. Uh, I'll uh, leave a link uh, in the description below, a link to this web page, and you would be able to um, to connect with Mark if you want. One last look at the watch here, at the actual watch, and uh, and that's it. That would be it. Um, I'll, um, I can also show to you how it looks like on my wrist, although I did that already before, um, but just to complete this um, video, as you can see here it is very nicely looking watch i'm happy to to wear it the way it is right now okay thanks and have a nice day